Hey, what's up, Chicago? So I'm here with one of my broker partners. Hi. Laura Bell, actually deemed LB. That's her alias. And Laura, how long have you been on our team for? Um, coming up on a year. Coming up on a year, okay. And so uh, you started with our team and I wanted you to share your journey about your attitude and how your attitude has made a difference in your performance. Because, you know, well, we believe and I believe pretty strongly that you know, your attitude and how you think about the world has a lot to do with your effectiveness and sales. So go ahead, share. Tell the world your, your paradigm shift and your attitude and how that's made a difference. I think a little bit of don't compare yourself to others has helped a lot because it's easy to look at Nick Reynoldman or Nick Leiber and see, man, they're doing so well, but they've also been at it for years and they've already gone through their own trials and tribulations. So that has helped. Just work focused on yourself and not what anybody else is doing. Another thing is when you're feeling a little more stable and you're not so anxious, you're able to do better. So you're not, you know, you're able to work from a place of enjoyment, not out of desperation, and that definitely helps a lot. And then your clients can feel when you're not enjoying your work. And when you enjoy it, it just becomes so much easier. Mm -hmm. And you were telling me too about how last, I guess, fall, winter, you were feeling more negative towards life, mm -hmm. if I could say it that way. Sure. And then you really started to think differently about life and then all of a sudden the same appointments you were getting before you started to really close and and succeed with and really elevate lives and all that so talk to us a little bit about that how your positive attitude has affected your performance i guess changing your way of thinking not everything is personal not everything is about you somebody you never know what is going on in somebody else's life so they may not be ghosting you they may have just had an issue or in their own personal lives and just make sure you're available and eventually it'll come back around. Yeah, that's good. So what I heard you say there is basically understand it's not all about you. Yes. <laughs> and isn't that amazing how that can make a big difference in your attitude when you start to think about life is not just what you want, but how to get others what they want, not just how to elevate your life, but how to elevate others. And many times in giving is when you end up getting. Yes. Come on. And how's your year been so far? It's been really good. This is my best um, coming up. I'm going into year three and this is my best one yet. I've already outsold what I've done all of last year. So, Wow. Come Yay. on. <laughs> Keep up the good work, LB. And I hope that's encouraging you guys. So tune in to us next week <laughs> or before then or who knows when. Think about your attitude and your self-talk first. And that's going to help you perform and do well with the people that you're serving. All right, everybody. Peace out.